It's remarkable to be here, it's remarkable to see so many familiar faces, older faces. <laughs> uh, Speak for yourself. I know, I know we're all older. <laughs> it is an honor and privilege to be here. Uh, and I, I'm just, I'm, I'm blown away by how welcoming you guys have been now and how unwelcoming you were 20 years ago. <laughs> I was reminded tonight by something someone said. Uh, when Christian and I, my cameraman, got to that tent at Camp River in the Kuwaiti Desert, we thought we were going to be welcomed by heroes. You know, Fox News is here. Oh, you know, these guys are going to be all over us. And and someone was like, really? That short with us? And we said, okay, you guys put your gear in the corner right there. That's your corner of the tent. And nobody talked to us. Not a word. And Christian and I are sitting there looking at each other going, what the fuck is going on? <laughs> Do they not like us? Do they not want us here? Don't they know we're Fox News? <laughs> um, it, it took a little while uh, to gain the trust and I guess respect of you guys. And it was, it was, it was great to earn it uh, because it was the most incredible experience of my career, one of the most incredible experiences of my life altogether, uh, and it's something that I carry with me to this day. I, I, I think about it all the time. It, it made me the man I am. It changed me in, in so many profound ways, and I, I'm just gonna go off, I'm not even gonna read my notes, because I, I, I just wanna tell you from the heart that that experience changed me. Uh, being in the desert for, and I, nine weeks for me, was a really long time. And I know you guys were there for months, and in some cases years. And I went home a changed person. I was a shell of what I was when I left. I lost 18 pounds, but that wasn't why I was different. I mean, I looked pretty good. You know? I was really dirty. But I just, you know, I, I, I couldn't believe how people took everything for granted. And I couldn't believe how the little things uh, meant so much. Like, I didn't have a cold drink for nine weeks. I didn't have a warm bed to sleep in. Um, and I didn't have a shower for 31 days. And, you know, I, I went home and I was just like, you people have no idea what it's really like out there. You have no idea what's, what, you know, you, you don't know suffering. You don't know sacrifice. And you guys know sacrifice. And you know suffering. And you did it without complaint. You guys were, were dedicated and committed and focused and impressive. And I, I went into this, with my hand up, I wanted to be embedded with the Marine. And I didn't really know what I was getting myself into. But <laughs> it was the hardest thing I ever did. But you guys took it in stride and you never complained. And one of you mentioned the sandstorm was ridiculous. I mean, <laughs> it was a hurricane of sand, is what it was. And I mean, I, I just, the, the, the overall experience was so meaningful for, for me and for Christians, and so life-changing that I can't ever thank you enough. It is the longest chapter in my book, Chasing Catastrophe, that <laughs> Sharing highlights of the event. 
<laughs> but, you know, I, I do have one regret from my experience in Iraq. Right here. It's that I left two days before you guys read <laughs> Baghdad, you're going around Baghdad, and our whole point was to get to Baghdad. And so we managed to arrange for a transfer to the 223 Marine Reserve, who were awesome. But it must have been, I don't know, two or three days later, I find out <laughs> that General Clarity, I think, I don't know, was it, was it Alpha Company or was it? Delta. 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 Sorry. No, of course. You kicked my ass when I'm done. I will. <laughs> <laughs> but I found out, and, and, and General Clarity was like, oh, we would have gotten into that. We would have we made sure you got the video. And I'm like, I missed the most exclusive amazing History-making. 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 History-making rescue. John rescue. rescue. You, you by right. Delta Company of the 3rd LAR, and we were with you guys for weeks. <laughs> Who told your story first? Well, look at now. Yeah. <laughs> Thank you guys. 